Well, good morning. Um, it's, it's humbling to be standing behind this podium in this room on the third Monday in August, and it's, it's humbling for, uh, for several reasons. Um, I'm, a, I'm a little emotional right now because I remember sitting in, in this very auditorium in one of those seats right over there on August 24th, 1998, 16 years ago. I was scared. I didn't know anyone. I was convinced a mistake had been made, and I was waiting. I was waiting for Al Turnbull, who was then the Dean of Admission, to come tap me on the shoulder, gently usher me out of the building with a hug and an apology, and then send me on my way. <laughs> this is Virginia, after all, so I expected it to be done cordially, but I expected it to be done. <laughs> Um, you know, of, of course that didn't happen, and, um, and, and while I didn't know anyone on that first day, unbeknownst to me, I was sitting in this very room with some of the closest friends I'd ever make in my life. Um, included in that group are a cadre of us who couldn't stay away from Charlottesville. Um, we, don't, we don't have a great many assistant deans at the University of Virginia School of Law, but four of us are classmates um, who sat in this very room listening to speeches just like this one. Dean Polly Lawson, Dean Jason Trujillo, Dean Jason Dugas and I, we all sat in this room and, and, and they are not just my friends. They are, um, they are part of my extended professional family. I'm sorry, excuse me, they're part of my immediate professional family. <laughs> um, and yeah, as, as often as we have to talk to each other, you know how immediate that is. Um, after three years together, everybody in this room on August 24th, 1998, they were a part of my extended professional family. And that's the Virginia law difference. Please, each and every one of you realize that. The people in this room sitting to your right and your left are likely to include your future attorney, the general counsels of your future clients. They will be at your weddings and they will be excited to receive pictures of your children as they are born if they are not there the day your children are born. <laughs> They will get you jobs in times when that is necessary, and they will be the ones you call when your daughter needs an internship. <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, every law school in this country teaches promissory estoppel, every single one of them, but not every single law school in this country cares about building community the way we do at the University of Virginia School of Law. Please be the next class that continues that tradition. That spirit of community won't move forward without you. But that leads me to the second reason I'm humbled to be standing here this morning. I'm humbled to be standing in front of this very group of people, you people. Good Lord, are you an impressive group of men and women. You've worked in the State Department. You've been professional baseball players. You've succeeded on Wall Street. You've studied neuroscience. You've served the community around this country and around the globe in, in Brooklyn, in Philadelphia, in Afghanistan, in Saudi Arabia, in China, and just about everywhere else any of you could conceive, that is where you have been. You've all done amazing things. You've been to amazing colleges. You bring unbelievable experience and diversity to this building. So much so that if I had to put my application up against the ones you all submitted, I could not admit myself. <laughs> That's not a joke, I really couldn't. <laughs> you guys are really qualified. Um, <laughs> But, um, but all of that is not why it is so humbling to me to stand before this group. Everything that impresses me about your resumes is to be expected. This is a top 14 law school. That is to be expected. You are supposed to be impressive on paper. What makes this group different from every other collection of law students that will begin classes in the coming weeks around this country is that you possess the unique mix of high IQ and high, high EQ that makes Virginia law special. You're not just smart, you're good people. You're good human beings. How do I know that? Because we talk to each and every one of you. The people in this room had me running down the hall to Jennifer Halvey, our director of financial aid's office, saying, Jennifer, you won't believe this guy I just talked to. You're going to love him when he gets here. <laughs> you had Jason Duga saying to me at lunch, oh my goodness, you won't believe this person I just Skyped with. She's in Asia. She's amazing. We had a great conversation. Who you are as people in many ways is as important to us as how smart you are and how accomplished you are. 
The combination of high EQ and high IQ is why so many employers will show up to interview you all 12 months from now. Why so many of our grads stay and make partner and ultimately become managing partners like Warren. Why so many grads are sought after to become general counsel of corporations, universities, and nonprofits, and often wind up leading those organizations. Why so many of our grads are hot commodities on the clerkship market and why the justices of the United States Supreme Court look to the University of Virginia in Charlottesville to find clerks for their chambers. I'm so humbled to be standing in front of this group of people, honestly, because I just like you. <laughs> I can't wait for, um, for everyone in this building to meet you, but I do have to ask you something. Don't prove me wrong. <laughs> I want to dare each and every one of you to believe Believe in yourselves, believe in this class, believe in this faculty, believe in this dean, believe in the University of Virginia School of Law. This isn't just some law school that, the, that US News just happens to like. This is the University of Virginia School of Law. Protect our community. It is now in your hands. This place changed my life. This place changed Jason Dugas' life. This place changed Jason Trujillo's life. This place changed Polly Lawson's life. Believe in this place. Work with us. Help us, and we will help it change your life as well. Four members of my class came back to help run this law school and stand with an amazing set of colleagues. Why? Because we want you to experience the unbelievable and limitless life poss possibilities that are waiting for you when you hold a degree that says the University of Virginia School of Law. Welcome to Charlottesville. Welcome to the University of Virginia School of Law. Welcome to our community. Thank you.